social banking from GT Bank. Anywhere, anytime, any device. No, I'm Eku Edewo. <laughs> I'm Cassiana. And you're going behind the scenes on our twin cover shoot for Genevieve magazine. Enjoy the madness. <laughs> you're crazy. I would describe Eku's personal style as very eclectic. She loves to work with prints and colours and you know like never never shy to experiment. Which is, you know, which is very, you know, like Tell them what you used to call me when I was a child. I used to call her clown. <laughs> because I thought, I thought that her style was a little bit too out there. You know, but you know, whatever, I think it's now become her signature today. And so I guess she needs something I didn't. I just think that I now, think like, oh. crazy's in. You know, like, things not matching. And um, I've always been irritated by the trend that uh, when they're like, you have to match your shoes to your bag and all that. Yeah. So. So yeah, so that's how, how would I describe it? I would say one word eclectic. Forward thinking. Okay, fine. In one word, forward thinking. Two words, forward thinking. <laughs> um, how would I describe Kessie's personal style? Hmm. Well, it's very clean. Um, she can do sporty looks. She loves white t-shirts. She loves uh, monotone. She loves greys, blacks, khakis. She has that very Angelina Jolie style, um, which is very clean. Yeah, clean. very clean, very classic. So I would say you're channeling. Or no, you actually, I actually had the perfect word. Um, I would say it is cutting edge classic. You know, I'm very good at my words. That's why I'm on TV. <laughs> <laughs> My style icons. Um, I, would, I tend to go for editors because I feel I think I work in fashion. I like to go for the people who create the looks we see on magazines or the people who, who are being put on the red carpet. So I would say people like Taylor Tomasi, Emmanuel Alt, Barbara Mattello, Christine Centenaria. These are all editors for our top Vogue magazines, and I I really respect their everyday street and tutorial style. Um, I think that with my style icons, I'm always interested in people that have a personal style that isn't dictated by trends, and it's more dictated by a mood. Like, um, I find that now Mira Dumaslava is becoming a lot more trendy, but when she first started with her street style, it was very organic. You know, her pieces were really out there. She could be wearing like an over-the-top necklace and dungarees, and I thought, I really like that. And, you know, um, I like, you know, I have to admit it, you know, I'm one of those people, I, I love Carrie Bradshaw, she's like one of my style icons, and I'm sure a lot of people are like, oh, but she is, because I really loved Sex in the City, I thought it was a real turning point for me to see somebody that was attracted to the same kind of weird things that I was attracted to, that everyone was like, oh, it doesn't go, why were you putting a big old flower in your hair when you're wearing, you know, when you're wearing, you know, the, an outfit that yeah, doesn't so necessarily go. Yeah, yeah. You know, be able to experiment and have fun with fashion. Exactly, have fun. You know what? And the Olsen twins. Yeah, my gosh, the Olsen and twins. And the Olsen twins, you know. Of course, I, I the just Olsen find, twins. I find them, you know, I find them, when you talk about icons, that they have really created a style that is such a signature. So yeah. I think they have become mini icons, don't you think? Yeah, and I think it was just, you know, since it is a twin cover shoot, the Olsen's are great ones, basically, the Olsen twins. As a, as a group style icon. <laughs> My style tip for the summer is white on white on white on white. I love that trend, I'm loving that trend. You can do it in any way, you can mix up the materials, whether it's lycra, linen, But you can't leather, do it cheap, denim. you can't do it too cheap. Definitely can't do it too cheap, because nothing where it looks, there's nothing that looks worth a cheap white. <laughs> so I think, um, you know, definitely put a little investment in it and then rock it out. If you happen to be lucky enough to get into Europe and enjoy, you wear Basically, white Basically, if you're going to wear white shorts, make sure that they're not see-through. Yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> that's always fair, isn't it? Um, I think style tips, I think that awkward lengths are in, um, mid-calf skirts and crop tops, um, that's what I mean by awkward lens. Um, things that you ordinarily wouldn't think together. Like this outfit I think would be great for the summer. I think this with some sandals and a nice summer bag and you're good to go. And one tip I would say that I always do is that um, designer dresses that I've 
um, maybe had for years um, that were evening pieces. I just put them with sandals and I turned them into summer dresses. So that's my style tip, recycle. <laughs> Hi guys, if you just enjoyed watching that video and you want to stay up to date with the latest in entertainment, lifestyle and more from inside Africa, why don't you hit the subscribe button right now. And if you want to keep on watching videos, then just simply hit the more videos button.